So earlier in class today, I had a student ask me, hey, professor, how do I make my side control better? I was like, don't. Let's just go do a different move. <laughs> so my reasoning was, you know what, look, it's important. You should know side control and, 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 and work on that and practice it. But you know what, sometimes you just get a strong opponent uh, with a lot of movement and you know, instead of just fight in one direction, change and go and flow into another direction. So that's an example of this move. So I land, I land here, somehow I land here. Maybe, you know, maybe, maybe I pass guard, maybe I'm, I, I, you know, who knows, maybe I throw him, but I'm entering into this classic side control condition. But, you know, my opponent is big, he's strong, he's moving, he's causing me trouble, right? He's getting my hips off the ground, he's, he's, he's framing. I'm not feeling this side control. So what I'm gonna do, right, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna kind of two things at once. I'm gonna post my right hand on the ground right next to his hip like this, like a ramp. I'm gonna shoot this left hand on the other side of his body and I'm gonna change, boom. I'm gonna change over to this position right here. So in judo, they call this Kamishiho Gatami, or Kazuri Kamishiho Gatami, uh, otherwise known as North-South. So once I get here, I'm looking immediately for this lapel. Once I get this lapel, I pull it down. Now, I can stay here, and can con continue con controlling, but eventually what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna look for this left, this other side. I'm gonna look for under here, this other underhook. I'm gonna grab the other lapel. Once I get that, that's it. It is extremely hard for a human being to try to get out of this position. Even just like this. I mean, this isn't how I'm going to do it. I'm just showing that even without my body pressure, he's being controlled. But I'm going to try to control him. I'm going to try to smother him. I'm going to try to take his breath from him. I'm going to try to take my hip bone and drive my hip bone into his face. I'm going to do all that good stuff. And then if he doesn't tap, I'm going to pull this out of my hat. Right here. Right on the karate, and I'm gonna pull, push. That's a good one right there. Sometimes they'll block, sometimes they'll push that away, and you go the other side. Boom! You know, he might start getting squirrely and getting, you know, all, you know, like, hey, I gotta get the heck out of here. I could always go back to controlling. Back to controlling. So, this is basic uh, north south control. Thanks for watching.